What do you think of GE versus Bosch refrigerators? GE's under-the-counter fridges and wine refrigerators have high scores because there is little to go wrong with them. I'm looking at fridges with freezers and space for a family's groceries. GE fridges need to be defrosted often because of their ice buildup. As long as it doesn't flood my house like a Whirlpool's nightly defrost cycle, we're fine. GE makes great turbines and MRI machines, but their ice makers leak. Part of my opinion depends on how badly it leaks. Are all GE fridges bad? GE fridges aren't all bad. Their artistry line is pretty good and quite affordable. What do you think of Bosch fridges? For as much as they charge for their refrigerators, they should never break down. Sounds good so far. As they say, you get what you pay for. No, it doesn't, because they do break down, often. What is wrong with Bosch fridges, aside from the price? Their control panels tend to go on the fritz. You push for crushed ice, it gives you water, and that's assuming it works at all. The problem might be the ice dispenser. Those tend to break too. But the Bosch fridges have problems with temperature control, electrical shorts and malfunctions in the very expensive control panel. I suppose that's what warranties are for. They take too many trips to solve the problem. Maybe they need to get the parts. Visit once to diagnose, come back a few days later with the parts. That's assuming the excuse is that they'll get the part back from Germany in a few weeks. Given that long await, I may need another French. Or buy a different one altogether. Which means I need to buy a G French.